Yo, um, part two. Uh, it's two twenty-two a.m. I really should go to sleep, but you know, I love you guys, so <laughs> I think I just go. I thought, yeah, let's look at the way Hua kind of pokes around with these standing D, standing C, D, and other stuff, and how to get past it. Now, of course, doing this like this is whiffing, and every whiff is vulnerable to an attack. So, obviously, you're really going to be doing it on like, like that to put you into block stuff. So, but, oh god, see, that's the kind of thing that happens. So what you've got to do is hit him first. One of the things you can do is use a, a light tap. If your move's faster than his, you're fine. If it's not, you're in trouble. So find a, a nice light tap that's quicker, and then you can follow it up with your own poke. Oh, but be careful. Look at that. It really is a case of predicting when he's going to do that move. A lot of them do kick 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 and into CD so you wait for the CD and then do your next move or if you know when exactly it is it's fine predict if you don't predict right right you're dead that's KOF baby uh, I think that's part two done you know all right see you later don't whiff your moves